Right now, 33 degrees here in the tri-states. We are hovering around the freezing mark. Right now, a little bit of cold rain out there at the Quincy Regional Airport, but it is just that cold rain. Winds right now out of the south at around 10 miles an hour this morning. And uh, as we head throughout the better part of the day, winds will continue to be gusty or grow to be gusty as this clipper system rolls through the tri-states. Now, here we go, folks, up near McComb. That's where a lot of that mixed precip is right now. Now, roads right now are below freezing, so when that rain does hit, more than likely it will freeze over, at least have a lot of slick spots. You see right here in McComb is where that pink arch is showing up up in Burlington as well as Lee County. Already getting reports of some slick roads, but that cold air is going to continue to spill in out of the north, making uh, roads to be treacherous out there. So do take your time as you do head on in this morning. Notice the precipitation is moving rather quickly, so it should be out of here by mid-morning. Nonetheless, going to make it uh, treacherous as you head on into work. Temperatures right now. Hovering right around freezing, 32 in Macomb, right here in Quincy, 33. Areas up to the north in Fort Madison and Keokuk coming in at 34 degrees. Wind chills on the lighter side, still around 10 miles an hour, but nonetheless, wind chill values right now around the mid 20s and uh, more than likely going to stay put and drop further down to the south as we head throughout the day as wind chill value is going to be in the upper teens throughout uh, the day as a wind chill or wind advisory will be in effect for us. Winds gusting to around 50 miles an hour for areas extreme uh, northern portions of the viewing area, say Fort Madison and Burlington areas here in Quincy. Winds could be gusting to around 40 miles an hour. And as we head throughout the rest of the week, we're going to see temperatures fluctuate and warm as we head on into the weekend. Right now, you can see that's where your precipitation is. It should move off to the east at a rather quick pace here as that clipper system is moving rather quickly here. Now the cold air gets to us in the latter part of the afternoon. There goes your precipitation. Should be precipitation free by around noon, but the clouds do stick around. You see highs occur around noon with temperatures dropping off in the afternoon. Tonight, 15 degrees as an overnight low. Going to be very cold with winds gusty today, as well as into the overnight hours gusting to around 25 to 30 miles an hour overnight. Wind chills likely going to be near that zero mark. As we head on into the weekend, you see breezy conditions once again as another system moves through on Thursday, and yet another one gets close to us on Saturday, giving us some snow chances on Saturday, but that is very slim chances, and we moderate as we head into that Martin Luther King Day.